Well, happening today, people from across the state will remember former Louisiana Governor Buddy Romer. Funeral services start this morning at Ashruma Baptist Church in Baton Rouge. That's where we find our Courtney Williams with more on today's services and how Governor Romer is being remembered. Hey, Courtney, good morning. Hey, good morning to you guys. Well, happening right now, they're actually bringing in the, uh, the hearse carrying former governor's buddy Romer's body. So happening today here at Astruma Baptist Church, they will have his funeral service. It's actually one of two services that will be happening in the state. Uh, former Governor Romer actually passed away last week at the age of 77 after a long battle with diabetes. But uh, the Shreveport native was a four-time U.S. Co congressman who also represented Louisiana's fourth congressional district back in the 1980s and he actually became governor of the state back in 1988 and during his tenure Romer increased teacher salaries toughened campaign finance laws legalized the state lottery and riverboat gambling and also during the middle in the middle of his term he actually switched political parties from Democrat to Republican and today he still remains the only U.S. governor to uh, switch political affiliation during an elected term. But those who remember Co uh, Governor Romer say that he made a positive impact with whomever he came into contact with and always want to put in work to make Louisiana better. Now, um, the family has asked that instead of sending flowers, those wishing to honor his memory to donate to the American Diabetes Association or to the Louisiana Association of Public Charter Schools Little Free Libraries Project. So the visitation does start this morning at 9 o'clock, so a little, a little under an hour and then his funeral service will start at 11 o'clock. And again, both the visitation and funeral service will be here at Astruma Baptist Church. And then he will go to his hometown of Shreveport on Thursday and there we'll have another funeral service. But we will be live streaming those services for you guys this morning. But if you want more details about the service and also just remarks from people who knew him, we have everything you need to know on our website. That's at brproud.com or you can download our free Be Our Proud app. Reporting live at Astruma Baptist Church, Courtney Williams, Fox 44 News.